Hey everybody, Tim here. Um, listen, about a year ago, to maybe two years, I don't know, I haven't been keeping track, I posted a video uh, about the Fender Blues Deluxe. It's a bargain basement harmonica put out by Fender. I think it's manufactured by East Top. Uh, they cost maybe eleven, twelve dollars. Um, and back then, I said these are really good harmonicas for eleven or twelve dollars. Well, that video, some ten thousand of you saw fit to watch that. Uh, a little humbling. Uh, it concerns me a little bit that y'all might need to get out a bit more. But anyway. Uh, in the intervening years, however, some other people have posted, hey, these things suck, nobody likes them, you know, don't waste your money. Uh, so I thought I'd buy a couple new ones and find out if the manufacturing had changed over the course of the years or if there was any reason to not like them now. Um, so anyway, I ordered two from Sweetwaters. Yeah, I think they're eleven, twelve dollars each, and you get a little bag full of laffy taffies. So overall, a pretty good bang for the buck, just in terms of what you get in the box. They come in these little, you know, plastic boxes with a hanky. I don't know what you would use the hanky for. Um, but let's just get into it. Let's see if these things are any bit as good as they used to be. Uh, they're shiny. I like a shiny harp. Decent heft to them. See if it's in tune. This is a C. I got a C harp and a B flat harp. Sound pretty good. So they're bright. They're bright, reasonably loud. This sounds fine. This is, it's easy to play. It's comfortable to play. It's got recessed reeds. You know, all of that stuff that I said in my first review, as far as I can tell, still holds. Yeah, all right. C, check. Eleven, twelve dollars. B flat. Let's see if this one's in tune. Yeah, a little bit of a pitchiness. Yeah. All right, the octaves, the top octaves, a little iffy. I don't know how many people play those top octaves, but. Had a little bit of an issue on the two blow there. There it is. Uh oh. All right, stuck read. I'll be right back. All right, so I'm back. I opened this one up with my little micro screwdriver and sure enough, the two blow reed, there was no gap. So I opened up the gap a little bit and now it's back. Uh, took maybe five minutes, no big deal.
So bottom line is, you know, I guess it's, it's a mixed bag as it always is. Um, the C harp was great right out of the box. No issues whatsoever. Playable sounds good. $11, $12. The B flat harp had one reed that was gapped poorly, uh, fixed it five minutes or less, and now I've got two perfectly good harmonicas for all of, you know, 22, 23, 24 dollars, whatever it was, and a bag of candy. Um, so I'm going to continue to say, for the money, they're pretty damn good harps. Anyway, keep on harping.